Hey YouTube here. Okay, this is Ultimate D, Paul as usual. And uh, just first of all, Happy New Year, Wayne D12. Hopefully you have a good Wayne D12 year ahead. So 20, 2011 was a good blast. I think there are some really good stuff that really did come about this really, really well. And uh, yeah. And I, that was probably a year I started doing a lot of video recordings. Especially I do a lot of gameplay too these days. So yeah, first of all, I'm gonna try to say that this year we're gonna do. I want to step up with more recordings and other sort of good stuff for my uh, other playthroughs. So yes, you can expect more good, high quality uh, HD videos, 720p or 1080p. So yeah, hope you can get those good things up and then expect more uh, Modern Warfare 3 style gameplay. Modern Warfare 3, for example, if you see the poster over there. Yeah, um, so yeah, this is the um, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, you're gonna expect more of that. So, yeah. Okay, next thing, I ha actually have requests of some games and or CD, beta, key, CD, whatever you can call it. Uh, because as a little bit on a low budget games, I would definitely, if possible, I want to try and get a few good sneak reviews on uh, this channel. Like, for example, uh, you been hearing about Defense of the Ancient 2, which is uh, created uh, by uh, Valve, the, the one who actually make uh, Half Life Counter Strike. Uh, yeah, I I really really want a uh, really really want a beta key. So if you can help me out. That'll be that'll be really really great. Okay, the next game will also be Diablo 3. I don't know when the heck is gonna come out because um, it has been delayed quite a fair bit. So yeah. So Diablo 3 has been very bad, but I definitely want to get a good a bad beta key or so, okay? So you can help me get a beta key. I'm good, that's cool. And yeah, so Dota 2 and Diablo 3. What else we forgot? Shit. Okay. <coughs> okay. Have a minute to go. Yeah. Dota 2, Diablo 3. Shit, what else did I forget? Yes. The Old Republic, Star Wars The Old Republic, okay, so uh, this is one of the new games, I'm trying to ask my mom see whether she can actually get it from, get it from me, because she worked in a Lucas Arts, Lucas Film uh, company somewhere in a cinema expo, so she has a lot of the stuff that's already been given to me, for like example that poster next to me, this one is the Star Trek Phantom Manners uh, one in CD, so it's gonna be slated to be in March 10 or something like that. So yeah. So a lot of merchandise has been uh, leaking into my place for Star Wars. I have an R2 unit out there. So yeah. So what else will we hear? Me? Yep. Gamers Haven. Being a new in StarCraft 2. I'm not sure whether I'll be continuing the series anymore because uh I haven't been really that much of playing with uh, StarCraft 2 these days. But uh, if I ever ever had uh, any interest to get back to StarCraft 2 to play, I would definitely do it. Right now, I'm still probably stuck in a silver league in a, in a Southeast Asia server. But in a North American server, I was in season 3 or season 4, I actually bumped up into a gold league uh, rating. So, uh, but how I got it was pretty damn lousy. <coughs> uh, can check out sc2c.com because I post a few plays there on my uh, wins and losses so for, for the North American playthrough. So yeah, okay. So that's about it. So the major ones is possibly going to come up with more uh, Modern Warfare 3 playthroughs and more uh, games that are coming up that I just recently bought on Steam. Like for example, like Bastion, uh, which I did play a game, we didn't play a bit. And also we have Trying and Magicka. Okay, so Trying and Magicka, those are okay in the games. Costume Quest as well, I actually bought it during the, the holiday game uh, pile uh, sale earlier last week. So that was a quick sale, I actually did I did buy the game. So it was good to start out with. It was a pretty good start with about two three bucks. So yeah. So I played that uh, a few of these games. And just a short summary of the games that happened last year is that in my own personal opinion, I think that the uh, indie games have really, really done a really good job. Uh, because I mean, in my personal opinion, I mean, there's a plan, there's a hell of indie games. 
which came out and were really, really, really successful. Bastion, Terraria, uh, Costume Quest, Dungeon Defenders. These few games are so those are really good indie games, and these ones are really worth to try. So yeah. Okay, so that's about it. Okay. Hopefully, I will see you guys next time. Peace out, guys. Happy New Year.